Criticate! Oh, fuck the welcome darkness! <laughs> fuck! Uh, welcome back to this shit. The darkness in your heart, Sora! The darkness. Uh, if you guys want to know, uh, I, I watched a video this morning that, that counted every time they said uh, any <laughs> variant that had the word dark or darkness, any word that had the word dark in it, mm -hmm. in the whole series, 781 times. <laughs> They say darkness I mean, so fucking much. Darkness is like, it's like the main villain of the series. Pretty much. I, but not really. Darkness can be used for good. That's that's something that I find that's interesting. That's something that I, I don't like light, as much. Light and darkness is very subjective to the wielder. It's just people who wield light have a big prejudice against darkness. That's that's what they retcon it to be. But in Kingdom Hearts 1, it's very much that darkness is evil. Well, yeah, that's kind of just how Maleficent is, though. She's kind of manipulating it to be evil. Uh, no, I, I disagree. Well, the, 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 we'll, we'll see well, as we'll the series goes on. But spoilers: you know, Maleficent's in this. I, game. I like the <laughs> Disney. I, the Disney. I like the idea that. <laughs> fuck! I like the idea that Disney is like light, and like Disney fights the darkness. Like the. I like it's, that. It's, it's like that's a cute. nice idea, but then they they retcon it a little bit, and it that's makes me fair. sad. I thought I'd find you fucking snoozing. This huge black thing is in my dreams. I just. <laughs> the joke is that Sora was sucking a big old black cock. No! What? <laughs> that was the joke? Yeah, I don't know if you guys knew that. Welcome to Funny Joe! We're, we're, we're going to make place. some funny jokes wow, so about our dicks. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, we need to stop talking. <laughs> I mean, you can watch all the cutscenes online if you need to. True, but we, we want the audience to pay attention. <laughs> you just want your girlfriend to pay attention. I do. I share <laughs> this with her. I mean, she can. It'll be entertaining we, to the audience to, as well. It, it'll be entertaining, but we can't just play like the cutscenes over. Well, d it depends on the importance of the cutscenes. That's true. Because we, we should be silent about the important ones. But I mean, this this conversation's about it's pretty essential. Uh, you know, Kyrie and Sora are talking about. They're childhood friends, and so, same with Riku. They've always dreamed about seeing... They've always been on this island for the, their whole lives, and they've always wanted to uh, I mean, go... Not, not this island specifically. Like well, this, this yeah, that's right. That's another retcon from Kingdom Hearts 2. In no. this game, it's heavily implied that... No. Cause really? He, yeah, because Sora goes from his house to this island. Oh, I guess you're right. Well, they're trapped on a very small, like, world space. Yeah, a very... like. A, I, I think Destiny Islands is supposed to be Japan. Yes. Like, just a series of islands. Yeah. And they've always wanted to go out and see different worlds and their best friends. Mm -hmm. And they've always wanted to explore. And, and they've, they've heard rumors that all the stars in the sky are different worlds. They didn't hear rumors. Or they think that all the... Sorry. I sorry, <laughs> no, fucker. sorry. It's just Kyrie. Kyrie's from a different world. Yeah, Kyrie is from a different world. And she doesn't remember it. And so they believe that all the stars in the sky are different worlds. And yeah. they want to visit them all. Yeah. And that's basically the gist so of they, that yeah. scene. They, they know that there's different worlds out there and they want to go there. Yeah, there we go. And so these fucking kids don't understand shit. So they're going to build a raft. Yeah, they're going to build a raft. on the water to go <laughs> see other worlds. We're going to build world. a raft to go into space. I think I had to talk to Kyrie first. Right? Do I have to? I, I probably think do. I think she she has to give you the list. This is this is something like the one part that takes for fucking ever to do, and I hate it. Oh, I love this. Uh, I mean, it gives <laughs> you a, a good, reason it's to a good explore. Setup. Yeah, it, um, and it teaches you the mechanics. Like you teach yourself the mechanics of okay. like collecting shit. You can choose to battle these guys, and they'll give you, you experience. You, do you want to battle any of them? Yeah, of course. I'm okay, gonna, yeah. I'm gonna battle each one of them. Yeah. I hate his voice. <laughs> hey, <laughs> what's up, buddy? What's happening, man? And these are he all Final so Fantasy characters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So these are characters. I believe all of these are from Final Fantasy X. I think so. I that's, think that's what. Oh I think no, it is. the girl over there is from Final Fantasy VIII. Okay. Yeah. Selfie. Or yes, selfie. Uh, isn't it? Is I think it your name might selfie. I think your name might actually be selfie. <laughs> I think it's selfie. Fuck. <laughs> are you? Are you Take just a selfie? Are you oh, just, I'm just. I'm farming him for experience. Oh yeah, don't do that. <laughs> This is the easiest way to beat him, though. It is. It does not take long. Just stun him and then it does go beat not the take fuck long. out of him. Yeah, no. Boop. Can you beat Riku at the beginning? Uh, I've always had trouble. Can I? Uh, I think I can on normal. I had hard time in proud mode. Yeah. He's tough at, like, at this point. Yes. Definitely, definitely. So what I'm doing, the, the, when I said farming, when you counter his ball back, it gives you one point of experience. That's that one P. Mm -hmm. So you can just stand there and farm him forever. Yeah. Uh, what am I at? Level three. No, I mean, like, what am I at experience-wise? 45. Yeah. 30 to get to the next one. And then you can so fight 
Let's beat the shit out of this Let's nice looking this. girl. Yeah. Ah, uh, that breeze feels so nice. And then Sora. <laughs> really do? She cleaves her skull in. <laughs> or he. Yeah, she's definitely because she uses a whip in that game. Ow. Yeah, yeah. Oh, but it's like Fucking a. It's more of a jump rope. It's that's a jump cute. rope. Yeah, exactly. But she uses a whip in the actual yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. really cute. I like that a lot. There's yeah. There's a lot of cute. I shit never really like fought that. these guys when I was a kid. Oh really? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I oh, didn't even know you great. could. <laughs> I, I know. I know that you can now. Yeah, yeah. It's just a. I love it as a game design thing because, like, it teaches you. Each one of them teaches you something different about the game and, like, yeah. how how the flow of combat happens. Yeah, like, 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 if you just run in and try and attack them, you will die. Yeah, every single one of them. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you if you play it smart, it'll show you the like the rhythm of combat. Yeah, like, like the guy over there, it, it teaches you how to counter projectiles. Right. She has easy to counter melee attacks. But she's also she'll whip you from behind if you're not. If you're not careful. Yes. Yes. So she has a lot of range. Yeah. And there are enemies that have a lot of range in this game. And then. And what makes this game different from a lot of RPGs, like say Pokemon, uh, is that it is an action RPG. Yeah. Uh, well, and a lot of people, when they think RPGs, they think turn-based, like say Pokemon well, or Final Fantasy. That's the genius of this game is that it's in it like it translates all of that Final Fantasy shit into an action game, and it yeah. does it so well. And it, it feels really good. Ow. What what is a what is a Titus teach you? Uh, I, I think Titus. he teaches <laughs> Titus, Titus, whatever. Yeah, people call him different um, things. They call he teaches him Titus you in, uh, in Dissidia. <laughs> he teaches you um, when to time your attacks because if you just go in and, and hit him again, he's faster than you. So yeah. he'll he'll hit you first, like if like that. Fucking exactly. So and you, he, it, you this, really this need kid's to be the careful. main character of his own game. So yeah. He's, <laughs> so he's the toughest of these three. Yeah, that's why he he was standing up there. He's 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 the boss character of the three. If you treat it like that yeah and he gives you two experience when you beat the shit out of him yeah because he's a fucking pussy <laughs> Let's see if uh, i can beat Rico. Uh, <laughs> uh, look up look up final fantasy 10 laughing scene <laughs> yeah it's, uh, it's weird. there's a scene where that person and they're all really aged down from their yeah. the, the counterparts in the game like well, like they're all adults and yeah well, well Titus I, I, is like a teen selfie's an adult i think the implication is that this is where they were as kids like we we spent time with them Yo, yeah as, as like this was their childhood and then they go on to do their own game yeah which is <laughs> this, this is game cool. clearly does not take place in the canon no of any it of, does yeah. not yeah but like I, li I like how there's a subtle implication that it might yeah yeah like there's then, but yeah but there's a part in the game where like we're like uh titus is all sad and this girl's like <laughs> if you fake a smile hard or if you fake a laugh hard enough it'll become a real laugh and then titus goes <laughs> it's funny it's so fucking <laughs> silly and if you look around this room you'll see little little cute plots shit and uh, uh there's supposed to be something i collect here maybe that's later it, yeah i think that's later that no yeah yeah you stuff. don't come in here yet do, 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 you gotta collect do, some fish do, in the water do, do, do. no that's that's the second one well, oh it is the second one you're right because there's two collectathon things which i don't like how there's two I guess. I like this first part way better than the second part. Do you want to get your shit kicked in by Riku? I <laughs> I kind of want to level a little bit. Aww. I, like, I want to get one more level before, what are the I, odds? before I try it. What are the odds? What do you mean? You just fight Riku right now. Uh, One in 50. One, one two, two, three, three 30. 34. Fuck. <laughs> Can you explain that game while I fight people and train? Uh, what are the odds <laughs> is a game where where you say, what are the odds? And then they say one and one, whatever number. And then you say one, two, three. And then you try and uh, you try and see who gets to the, the, um, the you, if, if you get the you same number, number yeah. the, the other person has to do it. Uh, we're actually going to, we're going to take a pause while Jacob level grinds. Yeah. Because it's not that interesting. So, so we'll, we'll be back in a second. Welcome back. What's up, Pose? We're back playing Kingdom Hearts. We're going to beat the fuck out now. of our best friend now. Hopefully. Riku's tough. Yeah. I'm going to cheer normal. for Riku. Uh, I'm going to go for the underdog. <laughs> you ass. Riku is not the fucking underdog <laughs> in this fight. You dick. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that log. <laughs> Boo. Yeah, got log. a log. All right. Fight him, okay. fight him, fight him. I'm going to get my teeth kicked in. Okay, you're on. So Riku is like, he has the weirdest attack pattern. Oh yeah, he jumps everywhere. He's, uh, you can't counter him a lot. Yeah. Fuck. Uh, that's because it, it's very it's very clear from a design standpoint that he has fought Sora several times. Yes. And so so he he is designed ah, specifically fuck. to counteract the way that Sora fights. Yeah. Because they're best friends and they play fight constantly. Oh yeah, all the time. So it's so 
it's 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 great from a from a, a detail standpoint. Yeah. Uh, uh, and that's that's no! what this game is. This game is filled I with fall tons into that of details. Every like goddamn that. time. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> I think you're gonna beat him. You're gonna beat really? Him. Yeah, pretty sure. He has a lot of health he for does. one of these starting characters. Yeah, because you're not supposed to beat him. No, you're supposed to lose. To, he's supposed to like motivate you to to get better and shit. Yeah. Oh, oh you I got him. Nice. Him. Oh, that was easier than yeah. I thought. Because the whole thing about Riku's character is he's your rival, who's yeah. your best friend, but he's clearly better than you in every <laughs> single way. And they give you that score system. Yeah, there's a coconut that dropped from the tree over there. Oh, uh, yeah, you're yeah. right. The, one of these trees. Right there. Which one? Oh, there it is. Uh, oh, you don't need no, those No, the green ones are the ones you pick up. <gasps> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah which I never understood that. <laughs> whatever. Um, so this, this whole setup is made for you to lose. If he knocks you off this thing, you lose instantly. Really? Yeah. Um, they, they do a score counter, which carries over to like the next section where you race him and yeah. shit. It's, it's all designed to get you to be like, fuck you. I'm going to fucking beat you, Riku. But also like him. And also friend. like him. Yeah, because yeah. it's just He's a friendly friend rivalry. rivalry. Yeah, yeah, it's not... It's not like a, I hate you. <laughs> yeah, you know, so and, cool. and, it, and it, it very, very, it sets up the fact that these these kids are all friends. Yeah, yeah, they are, and they, and they really really do love each other. Yeah, they they've been childhood friends. Which what else do you need to collect? Uh, I think I have, I think there's a coke. There's two coconuts I need to collect. One's over here. Yeah, but the other one I don't remember. I think it's. I think you could physically no. The see coconuts, them in the, trees. the next one. The coconuts are the next one. Yeah, let me, let me go check with Kyrie. Everything? I think it might. I have the cloth. Oh, I didn't get the rope because the rope is up near Titus. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're right. You're right. <laughs> we and played this got, game a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Quite a lot. And there's. Yeah. Was there one other? Which thing is going to help us speed right on through for the let's play. Yeah, which will be nice. Yeah. The rope, the cloth, two logs, and something it's else. It's the rope. Come on, fucking. And then you hang up? Titus. <laughs> uh, you, no, you wrap it around his neck and you he push him off, <laughs> and then you just hold it until he stops squirming. No, God, no. Wait, Titus, is that, is that not how the game ends? No, that's not. What game did you play? Kingdom Hearts. Find out that Robert played like a bootleg version. I played, I played a creepy pasta, <laughs> yeah. and I loved it. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I love Kingdom Hearts. The, the part where you kill Titus mercilessly. Yeah, and the part where he bleeds hyper realistic <laughs> blood. I just he cries bloody tears. Yeah, and Sora's eyes glow red, and he and his face gets really close <laughs> to the screen. Could be. We'll never know by staying here. Oh. Not far at all. Across the galaxy, Sora. <laughs> Maybe like space travel. Because it's not going to work, guys. <laughs> what if we meet a mouse? <laughs> just, a, just a walking mouse. <laughs> yeah, these kids handle weird shit pretty easily. Everyone does in this whole universe. Uh, fair. I mean, Jack Sparrow looks at a giant walking duck fuck and he's like, fuck that. yeah, dude. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> Makes sense. I get it. I understand and agree with what's happening. I mean, now. he's fighting skeleton pilots, pirates. <laughs> skeleton pilots. <laughs> I'm flying a bone plane. <laughs> this this scene is so iconic. They reference it in pretty much every Kingdom Hearts game. Of course, I love it. Because they're all buddies. Yeah. They're all buckos. <laughs> buckos throughout space and time. And, yeah. and their bond replicates other friendships throughout the series. And it's it's nice. Yeah. Friendship is a huge theme yeah. in all of Kingdom Hearts. Which is great. Yeah, it, you, you can see Riku's mouth did the weird fucking Yeah, I, I love it. When, when they have to... Because this was like early PS2. This was oh, yeah. <laughs> way early PS2. And one thing that I also love about this game is it's made with English voice acting in mind. Yes, yeah, uh, it is. Because it's Disney. Uh, Kyrie's fucking Hillary Duff, isn't she? I think so. She, she's someone really famous. I mean, for the Sora time. is Haley Joel Osment yeah. <laughs> from fucking Sixth Sense. Yeah, I know. It's great. And then uh, it changes voice Roxas after. in Kingdom Hearts 2 and the rest of the series, he's Jesse McCartney. Yeah. It's fucking nuts. It's great. I don't think she's isn't Hillary Duff, but I know that she's, she's someone big. Someone. I'm going to look it up. Yeah, sure. Clip, clock, clip, look clock, at that clip, running clock, clip, 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 clip. <laughs> He's so slow. I know it, it doesn't work when he's running slow. <laughs> yeah, it's it's great for gameplay. It's some great PS2 shit. Yeah, exactly. Oh yeah. <laughs> this this fucking blew everyone's goddamn mind when it came out. Oh like, yeah. Of Final Fantasy characters next to Disney. 
Like look this is the him. weirdest concept ever. Isn't he so fucking yeah, cute? Yeah, but it works. I mean, look at their like his design as a mage is meant to look more like Final Fantasy ish. Yeah, and then Sora looks like Mickey. It's like it's all designed to look like a perfect mixture. like like a perfect mixture. It's this is this is how you do like a crossover. I love that. <laughs> this is how you do a crossover series, man. I agree. This, this is like the perfect example. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be doing terrible Donald impressions the entire playthrough. Oh, you bet. <laughs> so look forward to that. <gasps> what the fuck? Mickey! Pluto! <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Kyrie's oh, Hayden oh, Penetier. Oh, she's that's She's really who it is. famous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's from Heroes. Yeah, she is. Wow. I loved Heroes, man. I like the first season of Heroes. Yeah, that's what I mean. No <laughs> one likes anything past that. <laughs> Another victim of the writer strike of 2007. This, this area is cute because you don't get to explore it in this game. There's yeah. only cutscenes, but in the second game, you explore this whole place. Yeah, and it's 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 rendered just like this. It is. It is cute. I I wish they had gone a little bit farther with it. Like a majority of the play gameplay for that. Well, whatever. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. I like it. I think it's a sure. cute little. It's a cute reference. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's and an it showed thing. that. Uh, canonically, Donald Duck has inherent magic is abilities that he can channel without using. Yeah. A <laughs> <laughs> so, so Goofy is like a fucking knight. Donald's a mage, and like they can actually fight, which yeah. is cool and weird. But I love it. <laughs> what? <laughs> His head just explodes. <laughs> I love how da like Daisy just has a really normal voice. <laughs> yeah, I know. I like the idea that Donald canonically just has a weird speech impediment. <laughs> oh yeah, no, he's not that he's a duck. It's really it's more highlighted in Ducktales when yeah. every other duck has a normal it's just voice. Normal, and he's like even Huey, Dewey, and Louie have normal right. voices in that show, and they normally don't. Right, right. Oh, it's me. It's fucking what's his name again? I forget. Um, I've played Final Fantasy X in a long time. It's Titus. Yeah, they do say Titus. The other one's Titus. Yeah. What is this? I think his name's Waka. Waka, that's yeah. it. <laughs> Waka, Waka. Yeah, God. I go in there. Do you remember that? <laughs> he just pulls out a fucking horn. He's like, Waka, Waka. Waka, Waka. <laughs> that's his thing. <laughs> she just really likes His the name's Muppets. like Michael, but is like that's why they call him Waka. Hey, and if you guys want to know how our Kingdom Hearts journey continues. Oh, yeah. Keep check watching. Check out the next episode of a Critic Kids. Please yeah, watch our show. Critical Kids. <laughs> yeah, the Critic Kids. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna make an annoying noise until you subscribe. That's what I'm gonna do. Uh -huh. did, you, did you do it yet? Just fucking, just do it. Ah!